Hey guys, what's going on? It's Uncle Muscles. I did a little video earlier today about uh, my Bixky, my Bixky and Barrow purchases. And I'm, I want to just do a follow-up on these mortar blocks because they're really, really high quality. So I contacted Bixky and they told me the rundown. With, what's the deal with this corrosion? It looks like on the inside. Notice that this is a little bit wet and that's okay. The, what I'm looking at and what I think is corrosion is actually 3M adhesive. Or so they say. Now to be honest, it really does look like adhesive now, on second thought. So, I'm going to trust what they're saying. And, uh, yeah, I would say that this is very similar to probably an EK block. I'm not really too familiar with EK stuff. I have XSPC, and the EK stuff, apparently this is a complete ripoff of. But I, I, I guess that EK Waterbox, I'm going to do a little research after I release this video, I use it adhesive, so I'm going to guess that Bixi uses a similar process, and that's why you see that little corrosive thing. Now, aside from that, everything else looks really damn nice. I did a little water test on this block specifically, and uh, I might open it up, clean it out, and reopen it, and close it back up. I, I, I think there's some leakage here, and that's okay. I'm not really worried about it. It's very, very high quality. Um, the real main thing about this heat sink if you're interested in actually looking at any of the any heat sink from anyone really is the it's huge the surface area on this heat sink is ridiculous um and it's not taking up a lot of space like it doesn't take up that much more space than well that's a lie it does take up more space but if you have an x99 chipset so if you're running you know uh broadwell or broadwell e uh i definitely would recommend this man it's it's really fine product. I have two here. Um, I told Bixi what was going on. They sent me two. They sent me one by accident and uh, I'm probably going to put that up on eBay or something like that. Um, they just basically gave me 90 bucks so I don't I don't hate that. Uh, but yeah, sorry for the mess here guys also. But um, I opened a bunch of stuff on the table and there's crap all over there. But yeah, so uh, that's it really. I mean this is this is a high quality product. Very, very high quality product. Um, the one little thing I thought was corrosion is not corrosion, it's adhesive. If you want to take that little piece out and replace it very easily, just use rubbing alcohol to clean all the parts, and then you can put everything back together. Bing, bang, bongo. Um, I think this is 75 millimeters? No, it's gotta be 45. It's gotta be 45 millimeters. I think from it's like a 45 millimeter square and that's the surface area thing i think the normal chip size is 25 or 30 or something like that but yeah if you're running a quad core or not really quad core if you're running x99 six core eight core or 10 core uh this is the cpu block for you you're definitely going to want to consider um throwing in some bad boy radiators like what we got here um you're probably going to want to have at least two 120s or a 240 for it. Um, yeah, that will get the job done. I'll be doing some more videos if you guys are interested in uh, this Bixky stuff, man. It's a, this nut is tough to crack. I have I I'm from what I know I'm one of the few people that own one of these water blocks. So I'm kind of pioneering, you know, Americans going over and trying to get these Chinese products. But I mean. You know, people say, look, it, it's a ripoff. E EK makes the same thing. I say, hey, look, it, if it does the same thing and works exactly the same and looks better than the EK stuff, I don't care who's ripping off who. I care about what product is going to work best in my machine. So, Bixky, uh, you know, accusations aside, they make a really excellent product. And I have never seen anyone else come out with this type of heatsink. It's huge and it's gorgeous. It's got beautiful micro channels. It's very, very, it, aesthetically, it's the best, it's easily the nicest looking water block, aesthetically speaking. Um, they also do the color for, uh, Bixky also makes the color for water blocks. So um, Bixky is kind of like the Chinese version of EK, essentially, when it boils down to it. Like you see how MSI works with EK or uh, EVJ works with EK. Bixky works with colorful. They make uh, graphics cards, they make, uh, well, they make motherboards 
And so this CPU block, I think, comes with one of their motherboards, and it has the colorful logo, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I think they also have the colorful water blocks for the GTX 1080s. So once again, these guys aren't messing around. It's not like, you know, okay, we just found the found the the diagram somewhere and how to make a water block, and we just kind of like whooped one together. No, these guys have been in the business for a very long time, and it's high-quality stuff. Um, like I said, I'm not too familiar with a lot of this stuff. I've never really seen the insides. This is like one of the nicest <laughs> things I've seen really for a computer. Uh, and so the, the corrosion thing threw me off for a second. I wasn't really sure that it was adhesive. So it's adhesive. We got that cleared up. Aside from that, um, the only other thing I wasn't really impressed with was the, the mounting. Like, so there's really not much to mount it with. There's no screws or there's no, uh, what is it called? Springs to go in. It's just you've mounted directly in. So um, I would like some of the tension to be kind of not present if that was possible but it seems like this is just goes directly into your motherboard and that's fine um but yeah basically really nice if you ever get the chance to communicate with them they're very nice people uh i definitely recommend their products man their customer support's like very very easy to work with obviously there's a language barrier um but you know what i'm had no difficulty and uh yeah so this is what it is, man. I got the Bixky. Uh, okay, so now the model, this is the, the CPU XPR. And that is what this is. It's the CPU XPR. And this is the only only version of this size of, of water block. Um, I will show you videos of this actively running. There's some other things I don't have currently, like a motherboard to actually put this on. So I'm waiting for that to come in the mail. But once that gets here, I will definitely be putting new videos of my streaming machine that we're going to be having up and running. Uh, for our leisure times, for our leisure times. So guys, once again, hit that thumbs up button if you like the video. Hit that thumbs down button if you're a loser. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you want to see more cool stuff on VR and water cooling and the like. Just dope ass computer shit in general. You know what it is. The topics don't change around here. And uh, oh shit, I just dropped something. But yeah, man, I'm very happy. Bixky, man. Bixky, Bixky, Bixky. Uh, product links down below in the description. And that's it, guys. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments. If you have any uh, comments about how crazy I am for trying to buy some crazy ass stuff that no one's ever used before. Also, whatever, ask me questions, tell me comments, tell me how stupid I am. It's fine. It's all good. Uh, I like doing this stuff, so, you know, the more the merrier. So, anyway, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it. And uh, check me out on Twitch, UncleMuscles.com. And that's it. Bye. Have a good one. Talk to you all later. Bonsoir.